Real quick guys, we're here in a service call. I'm actually bringing a doorknob to one of my technicians that they need for this project. Let's go to the car. All right, let's see. Doorknob. Let's go upstairs. So the hinges had to be, hinges had to be moved to modify existing to new hung. And then just you see the keyhole would have to be embedded into this side so the door can shut properly. How's it close? Good? Perfect. Yeah, perfect door. All right, very good. Okay, that was it here for the doorknob. Okay guys, so today on this video, what you've seen today was a service call. A service call is somewhere where I place a time, depending on the type of service call you pick, they are very good for you and affordable. So this service call was a door install. The only thing the homeowner had forgot or did not purchase the doorknob. And that's something that I already took care of because within the service call, I charged a price to get that project done. So any technicians or project managers as myself, they're on site, will go and purchase the doorknob as needed because the technician is already working on the job site and we don't want to make them slow down by them having to go out in the Home Depot again. So our service calls good? Yes, they are. Are they sometimes not good? Yes, sometimes they're not because the overall project estimated and scoped out and then written a number at the end will be much more feasible, productive, and so forth doing it that way. And that's where we'll give you that information when needed. Guys, until next time, I will see you on the next service.